Hey guys, welcome back to Rossoneri TV. I am Gio and I'm here for a new video to bring you the latest news going on at AC Milan. Now in today's news, AC Milan have officially announced that Montolivo, Antonelli and Calabria have all extended their contracts until 2019. Now I'm pretty happy about two players extending their contracts that are Antonelli and Calabria for pretty obvious reasons. I mean they're vital players to our defense. I think these two players deserve to stay at the club for the long term. And Antonelli's agent even mentioned that Antonelli wants to end his career at Milan and wants to give it his all for the shirt. As for Calabria, the youngster, when he was given the opportunity to play this season, I think he was pretty positive. Like we saw in the Coppa Italia final, he did very well. And I think in the long run, he could definitely take the Shio's place or Abate's place as a right back. In my opinion, I think he uh, deserves it because he's played very well. And I've always said that Antonelli and Calabria are possibly our best fullbacks at the moment. So they both deserve to start. Uh, so who knows, maybe next season Calabria is going to get more playing time and he could overtake De Shio and Abate starting roles. The negative news come in when we talk about Montolivo because like many of you guys, myself, I'm not happy about this contract extension whatsoever. He's going to be at the club for another three years, that means three more years of captaincy for him. And I mean, he's not the worst player that we've ever seen in Milan's midfield but he definitely doesn't have the capability of holding that Milan uh, captain title because he certainly doesn't uh, have that leadership that a captain must have. So until now, I mean, he's going to be the captain, but maybe when the Chinese investors come in, something could change in that regard. So we're going to have to see about that. But as for now, uh, Montolivo will be remaining the captain. But I'm happy about Antonelli and Calabria's extension altogether. So let me know in the comment section what you guys think about these contract extensions. Also, Alvaro Negredo's agent is expected to be in Italy, according to some Spanish reports, to speak with Milan and Inter in order to propose his client to the teams. Now, the 30-year-old scored 12 goals in all competitions this season with Valencia, and he's still under contract until 2019 with them. Uh, in my opinion, he's not the player that we need at the club. I mean, he's approaching his 30s, so uh, we're probably going to have to pay something for him since his contract expires in 2019. And I'm not quite sure that he's definitely the player that's going to change things for us up front. So in my opinion, Negredo is a no-go, but uh, let me know if you guys have different opinions about him or you guys agree with what I'm trying to say. Let me know in the comment section, guys. Don't forget to subscribe to Rossoneri TV to stay updated with everything going on at AC Milan on a daily basis. And I'll catch you guys later for another video. This has been Gio signing off. And as always, Forza Milan. The Chinese investors have made their intentions clear and they are targeting Unai Emery uh, from Sevilla as the next possible coach uh, if they do take over the sale this summer.